Hi Ben. Hi. Hi Alex. Hi Ben. Hi Ben. Welcome to... What are you doing here? <laughs> oh, I <laughs> see you here. Fancy a game of Shadespire? Hey, why not? Let's play a game of Shadespire. Bam! What's that Welcome to Shadespire. Welcome to Shadespire. So, tell me about your boys. These are your boys here. Yeah, yeah. So, I've, I'm playing Corn. Warriors of Chaos or something like that. So I've got this dude here is my leader. He's Magor Red Hand. Mm. Um, he's a macabre transformation, something, something. I don't. Know. Yeah, <laughs> he's like a yeah. champion of corn, right? Champion of corn, exactly. He likes killing stuff and collecting skulls. That's kind of kind Perfect. of his bag. He's got like a couple of lackeys with him. Mm -hmm. um, this guy here is Gartok Flay Skull, Ooh. which isn't going to get you very many job interviews. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like that, I don't think. Well, depending on what you're interviewing for. Uh, well, if you're interviewing for marauding gang of blood letters. <laughs> well, it might be exactly the sort of thing, yeah. Mm. This guy here is Zarkus the Blood Sighted. Oh. And I got a dog. Oh, you get a dog? Yeah. I want a dog. I know. He doesn't have the friendliest of names, though. It's called <laughs> Riptooth. Oh, yeah. he's a boy. And apparently he's fierce in all sorts of horrible things, so maybe it's not the sort of dog you'd have at home. <laughs> right. Um, it's, it's actually, well, it's a, I suppose it's a flesh hound of corn, isn't it? Yeah, that if someone's like tame to follow them about. Yeah, but yeah, he's, he seems like a, like a happy little bunny. Okay, then we've got my guys over here. Mm-hmm. Boom. They are Stormcast Liberators, I think, if I'm saying that correctly. We've got... <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you saying this is all a little bit newfangled for you? It's all a bit new, isn't it, and different to what I know. It's I, not proper Warhammer. I think Age of Sigmar has been out for long enough now that we've got to start making peace with it. We do, And this, we? this might be our, our little way into it <laughs> yeah. by playing a bit of... Yeah, I, bit well, of I'm going to try and get used to it, because, you know, I know what the corn guys are up to. Yeah. With Chaos Marauders, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. We've got this guy. He's Severin Steelheart. Mm. He's like a brave and noble paladin with a big sword um, and his buddies are um, Angerhard Bright Shield, this one here with shield and hammer, and the heavy Oberyn the Bold with a big two-handed hammer. Nice. So my guys, they're on a quest in the streets of ruined Shadespire Ooh. to re retrieve six ancient artifacts because once they combine them all they can summon Captain Planet. Amazing, like Voltron. Voltron, exactly. Perfect. So that's that's my mission. You've got your own missions. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I assume they involve murdering people. Yeah, mainly murdering people. Yeah. So <laughs> these are these are these are my mission cards, which cool. are random. So I don't know what I'm doing yet. Well, you'll but eventually I'll, do I'll all find, of them throughout I'll find the game, them. or none of them. Oh. <laughs> Exciting. <laughs> You know, if you get zero victory points at the end of the game, you don't like somehow leapfrog. Oh. It's not like hearts. Oh, are we not playing <laughs> playing a tournament? Or I sort of start at the bottom of the table and then just catapult oh, my way up. Oh, like a submarine move. Yeah, where you exactly. go down in the first round to get better pairings. Yeah, exactly, and then slingshot and just ace or, ace the next three goes. <laughs> right. Maybe. It's a bold strategy. Let's let's see how it plays out. <laughs> okay, so then we've got to um, place these bad boys' mm -hmm. objectives down. Yeah. And um, so they can't go. On the um, edge squares. On the edge or too close to another objective. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put one here. Cool. I'll have one over here. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to put one here. Is that too close to another objective? Uh, yeah, it can be within two. Oh, within two fools. Oh, and it can't be on um, one of these squares. That's like a deployment zone. Okay. Square. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Quite a long way to walk so all the way over there, isn't it? That the last one can go by an edge because mm -hmm. there's actually not that many places. Uh, left my last one, oh, there are only five. There's of these only five. Yeah. Ooh. Let's put it oh, there. That can be the dog's objective. Maybe. <laughs> well, the dog, the dog's got its own agenda. Oh, he's not. He's not really up with what the rest of the gang's trying to do. No, no. I've got, I've got one thing. So the, you know, these decks have been lovingly built. Yeah, Lewis built these for us. Yeah. So um, I look forward to seeing what I'm doing today. Well, I, I did a little bit of swatting up. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That sounds so, like book rules to me. Yeah, a little one. Well, no, they're on cards, so they don't really count. <laughs> right. Um, I've got some sort of an idea of how this plays, but I really need sort of the, uh, what are they, the let's notes. <laughs> about, <laughs> right. about sort of <laughs> exactly what these guys are supposed to be doing. Um, I think um, kill, main, burn. That's, that's Korn's like normal threat. Yeah. Oh, amazing. That was one that I was actually looking for. It jumped out at me. I think we're in that okay. They're not great. 
I'm going to see how I do. Oh, see, I've got more pictures of swords now. That's ah. pretty good. <laughs> that, can, that can't be a bad thing. No, not with Murder Squad. Exactly. Well, the kind of axes, but yeah. Right, <laughs> I'm, I'm good. Sweet. Let's um, set up then. Do you want to put the first guy down? You have to put them on a square with a little symbol on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to put my leader here. I'm going to put my leader here. Okay. I'm going to put this guy here. Okay, I'm going to have um, my shield guy up front protecting my leader. Nice. So this guy, Gartok Flay Skull. Mm, I, yeah, I'm going to put him here, I think. Okay, and then I'll have over in the bold hanging back. Ready to strike with the hammer. Mm -hmm. Hammer of justice. No, actually, I'll go over here. There we go. Okay. Um, and I'm going to put Rip Tooth there. Oh. I think we're ready to roll then, aren't we? Yeah. Should we do our, our secret strategies? Yeah, do you want to take a second? I'll, yeah. I'll step out. And, okay. Uh, I'll just go through my plans. Yeah. I'll, cool. I'll, go, I'll go for a quick, quick read of my cards <laughs> out, out in the hallway. Okay, so, um, like I said, the quest of... My guys are on a quest to get these cards. These are the Catafrontone's plate. But there's also a helmet and some gloves and some boots. And if he completes the set, they get more powerful the more he has. Eventually, if he has all six, it becomes super duper powerful. So what I need to do is each one of these will cost me a victory point to deploy. So I need to complete some small, quick objectives to then start equipping the gear. So my plan this turn, I've got two objectives I think I can do. Bloodless, which is uh, no one takes any damage this turn. So I just need to turtle up and hopefully I'll get that. And Unbroken Wall. And if all my guys are touching in a group, let's say score this in the end phase, if all surviving fighters, at least three, are in a single group with each friendly fighter adjacent to another friendly fighter. So I just need to move Oberyn Hammer over here, and then bam, got that. The last objective is Chosen Champion, which is one of my guys has three or more upgrades. I'm not gonna be able to do that this turn because each upgrade will cost me a victory point. Don't have enough victory points yet. So two out of three ain't bad. I just need to basically hunker down and hopefully Alex doesn't do me any damage. Right then, so I've got a couple of plans here. I've got a few things that I'm not 100% sure what the rules of them are, because I haven't really played this very much. But some of these I might be able to do, but I doubt it. The big one that I'm really after is trying to get the dog to, um, to eat Ben's leader. Um, so he has to finish him off, so I'm going to try and wear him down with something and then finish him off with the dog. If I can pull that off, I'll be a happy man. And other than that, there's a few other bits here, but yeah, that's about it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I guess we should probably say, if you don't know what the hell's going on, watch Lewis's video yeah. where he explains the game probably in more detail than we are. Yeah, because, I mean, I'm, I, I don't know what I'm doing, actually. I've like <laughs> we'll played, played this like twice. <laughs> okay. so figure out what's going on. So yeah, my turn, mm -hmm. I suppose. So I've got like a choice of actions. I can do some yeah. moving. You've got, um, your choices stuff. are move, mm -hmm. charge, attack, draw a card, or do nothing. Or, go, or you can go on guard as well. You only get four actions each, mm. and then it's the end of the turn. So you could do one guy four times, yeah. but they can only move once. Well, I'm gonna charge my leader in. Oh wow, just going straight for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go, go, go and kill, okay. up, kill up Dr. Shields over there. Sure. So yeah. So, boop, boop. okay, I'm gonna, in response, mm -hmm. gonna play Quick Thinker. <gasps> What's that do? Uh, study the movement of your foe. When they make a mistake, do not hesitate to strike. I haven't made a mistake. That's a thought. <laughs> so, reaction after the enemy fighter moves, I may make a make. I may make a move with one of my guys mm -hmm. before you get to attack, and I'm gonna move my leader up. Mm -hmm. So now I've got like got you outnumbered. I've got some support. Nice. Okay, but then you get to make your attack. Right, so I'm going to attack you with my demonic axe. Uh, oh, are you still going for the shield guy or my leader now? Uh, going for your leader? Yeah. yeah. Okay, go for yeah, it. Yeah, I'm going to go for your leader. Um, okay, Ooh. so these symbols mean um, you would hit if you had support. Yeah. But he has no friends. No. So he misses. I'm going to put old... Um, Shield guy, mm. onto guard. Okay. Get ready up, get his shield up, and defend himself. And that's your turn. I'm going to attack your leader. 
mm -hmm. with this guy. Okay, I'm just going to throw another attack at him. Left, lefty oh, pointed. Actually, oh, oh, yeah. oh, because you've charged. He now can't move or attack the rest of the oh, I can't move or attack, that's that's mm -hmm. the whole lot. Okay, cool. So this guy is going to make a charge now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to charge your shield, dude. Okay. So, yeah. Boop, boop. It's a classic corn strat. Yeah, run forward and hit you. <laughs> yeah. It's quite, quite a finesse army. There's a lot to it. A lot going on there. A lot going on. <laughs> right. Okay. Amazing. Which so, one's he? Uh, that's Zarkus the Blood Sighted. Oh, shit. And he's got a weighty Gorax. Mm -hmm. uh, ah, Ooh. He's hit a hammer. He's hammer. hit me. So I roll um, a defense dice. Mm -hmm. And I got a... No, I need support for that to have worked. Mm -hmm. So you got me. How much damage does the weighty Gorax The do? weighty Gorax, it does two, two whammos on you. Oh man, two wounds. I'm half dead. My shield nice. goes. Oh man, being on guard did me no good, did it? No. Okay, trying to bring in the heavy guns. I'm going to bring in over in the bold with the heavy hammer. Ugh. He's going to charge. He's going to smack your guy. Okay. What's his name? The blood sighted. Zarkus, the blood sighted. Okay, take this, Zarkus. Thump. It's two hits. Ugh. So you get one, one oh. save. Mm -hmm. And um, it's one Ooh, save, one but save. against two hits, it's not enough. No. So I do three wounds. Oh, really? It's a big, heavy, two-handed hammer, man. No, and it doesn't sound as good as a bash. weighty, a weighty Gorax. But... It's a Sigmarite great hammer. What? What's a Sigmarite? Um, me? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think. I'm going to move this guy up. Mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. So Gartok Skull Flayer is going to go. One, two. Can you stand on this objective? Yeah, yeah, you can move the objective. So far far yeah, stand, stand in there for a second. Okay. Yeah. So he's moved but not attacked. Mm -hmm. And then in my go, I guess my um, my bright shield is yeah. going to try and finish off okay. um, that guy there. So I lose my guard because I'm attacking. Mm -hmm. um, and I roll two. Oh, three dice on that one. Ooh. And it's, uh, oh, it's a critical hit. Ugh. So actually you can't save it, because I've got a crit and a regular hit. Even mm -hmm. if you roll a crit, yeah. the regular hit gets through. So that's two more wounds. I think I've killed him. Oh, yeah. The blood he had, he had four wounds. So because the blood sighted. Just dead. cut down in his prime. Savage. Um, I, I get a victory point for that. Ugh. Oh, well, this isn't going quite so swimmingly. No. Can dog save day? Oh, I've got plans for dog, maybe. Ooh, Perhaps. dog plans. Maybe. Well, this is your last action for the turn, so know, now's the time for dog. Well, now's the time, yeah. What have, it, what have you got? You've I've still got, got one action an action left. afterwards, but yeah. this guy's not going to be able to move again. Yeah. These guys won't be able... Oh, can they make a charge still? They could, they could still charge, they yeah. They could still charge, yeah. So you can move and you can charge? No, um, so when you move, you, you can't move anymore. And okay. when you charge, you can't move or attack anymore. Okay, so, so if you these wanted... guys did move. No, he, uh, I did a special thing with a card. No, that was a special, a special um, thing. Oh, no, no, I cheat. He has moved. That counts as a move. Okay. Card move. So my hammer guy. Yeah, so your hammer guy hammer, can still hammer, move. Sorry, shield guy yeah. can still move. It's only going to get like sorted up. I want to stay the fuck away from that hammer. <laughs> the hammer's I've killer. Learned isn't learned. It? <laughs> <laughs> I've learned something so far. He's good, always big, learning. Big hammer, big trouble. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I'm going to charge your leader. Dun, 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 dun. Dog attack. Rip tooth, here he goes. Three attacks, hit on swords. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a sword hit. Oh, and these have hit as well because you've oh, got a friend. So, I'm gonna assist. Yeah, yeah. so you've got three hits. Nice. Uh, so I need a crit save, which I do not get. No. So uh, what, does, what does bite do? Oh, bite, it's fearsome indeed. Is it two damage each time? Two damage. Yeah. Nice. So that's six damage. Oh no, or it's is it just a, that only one of my three. If you hit, you through. do your damage. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so both my leader and my shield guy are both half dead. Nice. I can't hit the dog, can I? Not really. <laughs> not in good conscience. No. So I guess my shield shield guy is going to also bring bring the little hammer down on your leader. Mm -hmm. Take this. Thwack, thwack, thwack. Oh, it's another crit hit. Uh. Oh, you're, um, we forgot something. What's that? Your dog has um, leveled up. Oh, he dinged. He dinged. He's now, um, what's the word? Inspired. Yes. He yes. turns gold. He's now ripped to inspired. Why has he done that? Um, your guys do it whenever they successfully 
attack and hit. Okay. Um, so one of your other guys hit me, didn't he? Um, you hurt my shield guy. Yeah. Oh, it was the heavy... Yeah, yeah it was the it dead was, guy. Yeah, okay, yeah. So Zartox dinged and then died. My guys ding when they successfully defend an attack. Okay. Which they have yet to do. <laughs> okay. Um, and I've got one attack left, yeah, so... Yeah, so what are you doing? Yeah, I'm going to bring the hammer down on your leader. Mm-hmm. Smack, smack, smack. It's a crit hit. Ooh. So um, you can't save that, actually. Because it's a crit and a hit. No. Um, so you need you just take two more wounds. And that's the end of the turn. So now's the time to like cash in any of your upgrades you want to keep mm. and chuck anything you don't want to keep. Uh, I'll cash in your objectives first, I suppose. Yeah. This one I was never going to do. So I'm going to chuck it away. Mm-hmm. Chosen Champion. One of your guys has three or more upgrades. Mm-hmm. That's not a good early game card. I didn't end up getting Bloodless, which is a no one is wounded this round. Because mm-hmm. the first thing you did was run in and wound me. So yeah. I was like, if that's off the table, <laughs> guess I'll hit you back. <laughs> Wasn't planning to hit you at all originally. <laughs> no. Uh, but it did get Unbroken Wall, mm-hmm. which is all my guys are together in base contact. Oh, nice. Um, so that's one for me. And then I'm going to spend that on giving the giant hammer guy uh, Cataphrane's Plate. Mm-hmm. which is the first of these mystical artifacts I've been looking for. Oh, nice. Um, on its own, does absolutely nothing. Perfect. But the more I get on him, the better. I put it on him because he's the only guy who's not half dead. Fair enough, that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> yeah. before, you, before you super Voltrons. I mean, if you got it on someone else, they'd be pretty good, though. And then I'm going to chuck all my other cards because mm-hmm. um, they're not good. So these, uh, these get burnt now, no matter what. You can hold on to them if you want oh, to. I can hold on to them. Yeah. Okay, yeah, cool. So I'm going to... Right. I'm going to hold on to both of these. Mm-hmm. I think they're quite important ones. But I didn't get Ploy Master. Ah, play a yeah. lot of ploys. It was a, a Skaveny thing. Yeah, Scritch's plans are coming together. Yes, 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 they are. Um, oh, okay. Did you so not have yeah. enough ploys in your hand or not? Uh, yeah, score using. at the end of the phase. If I played three or more ploys in the preceding action phase, it's mm. quite a, like, a lump of cards to... Yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm chucking, chucking those out, and I think I'm going to throw away some of these as well. Mm. This one I quite like. Yeah, and I'm throwing away these three. Okay, cool. They're not much fun. Shall I um, give you some alone time with your cards? <laughs> right, so I just pulled precise use of force, which is quite interesting. Score immediately if a friendly fighter makes a successful attack action that deals exactly enough damage to take their target out of action. So potentially, I can super combo that with the dog chewing thing and double combo up if I can whack his leader the same as I did last turn. So that's may be promising and this one is a show of strength where if my leader can kill one of his guys take probably this guy who's also wounded out of action um, I'm gonna get another objective on that I picked up a handful of stuff here that isn't great um, but I still have got something to keep my leader back alive if he does die so I've got to remember I've got that when my leader dies and not afterwards. Right, okay, so I've drawn um, two more of these artifacts I'm after. I've got Cataphrane's Locket and Cataphrane's Hood. So I'm going to try and get some more victory points, get more of these equipped on Hammerman. Um, my other of ploys, uh, two of them move enemies around. I've got Peel of Thunder and Distraction. So I can push the enemy around should play into my objectives. My objectives are Consecrated Area. Score this in the end phase if there are no enemy fighters adjacent to your fighters. So I just need some space. I need them to not be where I am. I've got Alone in the Dark, which is scored two victory points if there's no one anywhere near, no one touching anyone, which would be hard to pull off. And Perfect Planning, which is I don't move for this turn. And um, well, none of my people take a move action. I can be pushed around by events, so that doesn't count. So I guess my plan is to try and just push him away from me, score perfect planning and concentrated area, consecrated area. I think alone in the darkness is gonna to be too hard to pull off. No one touching anyone, because we're all clustered up in the middle. So yeah, just take it, take it slow, push him back with my um my two event cards, maybe use the hammer to push someone back, and then just stand firm, get more artifacts out, win game. If I get three of them out. I can reroll my defense dice and my attack dice. The key is to try and get six of them out, because then like, every action gets me four victory points, which is huge. If I have that by the end of the game, 
you know, it's just my turn, I get four points. Next turn, four more points. It's huge. So I'm just going to keep keep grinding for gear, see how it goes. Right, right, right. That's more than enough planning time for you. Yeah. Right. Let's get in there. Do you know right. what you Re do? Refresh your, um, your actions. Yeah. You got a plan? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> You? I, I, I've got the beginnings of a plan. Uh, we have to dice off to see who's the coolest now. Probably me. Grab, grab four dice. Um, I got all the hammers. All the hammers. For some reason, when you dice off, it's the assist symbols that are the the win. Sure. And then that right. sounds like I'm making it up. <laughs> I'm, glad, I'm, I'm glad I just rolled all of the hammers <laughs> off these dice. <laughs> yeah. It's not like they were going to come in handy use later on. So I'm going to go first. Um, okay. But you, um, what am I going to do? I'm going to, I'm going to go on guard mm -hmm. with my leader. Yeah. That's his action. He's going to defend himself because he's half dead. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if I can just go straight for my plan already. Seems a bit much. Seems slightly unlikely. I don't know, you've only got four goes. You've got to. Yeah. Putting it off is is dangerous. I'm going to attack shield guy with my leader. Okay. It's a hit. It's a hit. It's not Ooh. a defense. Oh, that would have been a defense if I'd been on guard. Wow. I put the wrong guy on guard. And I picked the right guy to hit. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> Pick the right guy to hit. You, you sure did. Okay, Shieldo. He, he's dead, I think. Shieldo's dead. Yeah, that does two oh, damage. Man, from two damage. That's accounts. enough to finish him off. And uh, you did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's it. So, McGaw, Red Hand is now McGaw inspired. Uh, pref, press F in the comments. For Agarhard Bright Shield, she did. Mm. So, mm. Uh, so you get you get a VP straight away. I get a VP straight away for killing, and then I score immediately. Mm. My leader takes an enemy fighter out of action. Ah, oh, nice. What's that called? It's called Show of Strength. Oh, he's showing off to his dog. Yeah, his dog knows exactly. who the alpha is here. My plans come unstuck a little bit. <laughs> What's happening? What? Nothing. You can still move later. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. No, 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 that's that's fine. All right. Right, and then the start of the next turn, I'm going to put Cataphrane's hood onto my hammer man. Mm-hmm. So he's now got armor plate. Oh, hood. wow. So he's he's starting to get the set. He is. He's building up. I don't know if it's such a slow thing mm. that I can just ignore him <laughs> until he gets super powerful, or if it's the sort of thing you need to nip, nip it in the bud bar immediately. <laughs> I'm not I'm like, sure. It's still going to be three against one if I can just kill your leader. <laughs> yeah. So that's kind of Maybe cool. if he's on his own, he's not so bad. Yeah. Um, you can now play an upgrade card if you mm. want before the turn starts. Can I do this as well? Mm. Uh, what did I... How many wins did your dude have left? Um, two. Two. It was exactly enough to kill him. And I did exactly kill you, so I can yeah. precise use of force that as well. Ooh, I didn't have to okay. use that on the dog. That's where I thought I'd messed up. He hadn't dinged at that point. So he was only doing two damage. I'd forgotten that the dog had dinged. I was going to maybe kill your leader with that. But actually, can I take that now as well? You sure can, man. That's another VP. Nice. Precise use of force. Yeah, so pre precise use of force. And, and a show, show of strength. strength from my leader. Showing, showing him how it's done. Okay. Oh no, you put your magic hat on, didn't you? So it's my turn. Uh, that's not actually a turn. Oh, that's, oh, that's just on. a. That's okay. just um, at the st before each player's turn, we both get a chance to play okay. upgrade cards and mm -hmm. employees and stuff. I'm going to spend my turn to draw an objective card. Okay. And then discard an objective card. Ooh. That's my new objective. It's called Flawless Strategy. <laughs> I'm going <gonna, laughs> to gamble on the fact that Alex like doesn't know what <laughs> Flawless Strategy is. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and I'm going to ditch sounds, this one, alone in the dark. It sounds strategic. Sure does, doesn't it? Okay, know. that's my turn. Just shuff in from, for objectives. I think if we play a lot more of this, we'll get a lot better at it. That's <laughs> with all things. Well, not all things. You're <laughs> pretty things. bad at a lot of things. Yeah, right? exactly. And there comes a point where you get really good at something, and then you've done too much weightlifting, and you can never use your back ever again, and you get right. really bad at stuff, worse than you were before you started weightlifting. Uh, yeah, because you blow your yeah, knees out. Or something. Yeah, yeah. What's Don't the wargaming equivalent of that? Stay away from sports, kids. <laughs> it's dangerous. <laughs> Simulated you, arena you combat. Get, you get you get burnout painting and stuff, I That's suppose, true. don't you? To the point where you just want to give up for six months and not even look at the things for a while. I'm, I'm going to put faith in my leader's defensive abilities. Oh, sounds like a 
fate. Have <laughs> <laughs> you got an amazing car? Yeah, just ref- I've got the obsidian yeah. amulet. It just reflects all damage back onto you. You, fucking, you might as well. <laughs> and I, I've got no idea what your cards are. This is half of the fun. So I did spend a bit of time looking at my cards, but you could have anything. Yeah, I don't know what any of your cards are either. I'm just playing my. I'm playing my game. You're playing your game. We'll see how those two things come together. I have no idea. Yeah, I'm going to attack with Rip Tooth. Okay, you still can attack with your leader again, just so you know. Like, um, no, 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 no. I'm going to attack attack with Rip Tooth inspired. Okay. Yeah, go for it on your leader. Book, 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 book. Uh, oh, it's a crit. A hammer and a crit. And a hit. Oh no! Faith is my shield. Oh, no, he's no. not. He's dead. Oh, he's dead. He's nommed him. Oh, Rip Tooth. You've dinged again. The bane of champions. I oh, pulled off the plan perfectly. What is this? Old Ripty's picky about what he eats. He favours the taste of foolish heroes. <laughs> oh no! Foolish heroes. Good yeah. immediately if Riptooth takes an enemy leader out of action. Oh, he's the goodest <laughs> boy! <laughs> wow, so you're on um, six. Yeah. Six VPs now. Six mm-hmm. Glory, I think it's called. Yeah. And I'm on two. Mm. Oh man, that is rough. Okay. Um, I've, done, I've done all my objectives for the turn. I can just start looking at these now. <laughs> Stop spending <laughs> see, them. See if I can do, do whatever these are supposed to do. Oh my god. I'm just rummaging around with uh, over in the bowl looking for treasure. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> he's just left his comrades to die while he's like <laughs> opening chests, kicking over barrels. <laughs> just generally, like, here he is. <laughs> just, Here's the corpses of his friends. And he's just like, don't mind me, I'm getting a loot. I need a new hammer. <laughs> Look at the shiny helmet! You've got a lovely hat (laughs) and a nice new bodice. And then come at me. What Mm. what you got? Oh man. So I can still charge if I've attacked. Yeah. Um, Oh, who do I send in? I mean, he's. he's, Your leader's in bad shape. Well, see, um, um, I've got no wounds. Your leader's got two wounds and everyone else is fine. Yeah. But then my leader is like a bit of a monster. Mm. Actually, no, he's not actually any better than the dog. Well, the the dog has. um, this, on a dice, there's two hammers and one sword. Okay. So the, although the dog rolls more dice, he's effectively looking for sixes, mm-hmm. whereas your your leader is looking for fives. Okay. It's the equivalent. Yeah, let's let's throw throw doggo in then. No, let's throw my leader in. Okay. <laughs> he charging. Here he goes. Yeah, Magor inspired is going for it. Okay. Hit me. Mm-hmm. Hit me. Hit me. It's a hit. <laughs> oh. Okay. Um. Ooh, a swerve. Ah, oh, if I'd gone on guard, <laughs> that would have been amazing. No, you were too busy rummaging around looking for treasure. <laughs> yeah, I was. <laughs> so what does he do? Two wounds? Three uh, wounds? Three wounds. Yeah. Oh, I've got one wound left. I'm going to go on guard. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So I suppose my final turn. Mm-hmm. I mean, Gartok Flayskull hasn't done all that much with this life, but I do only need to knock one wound off you. The Flayed Skull guy, like, he's the only one who hasn't dinged. I know, I know. <laughs> It'd be disappointing to murder you to a man um, without having dinged all of my guys. <laughs> I know, right? but, it, but it's kind of like a side quest. There isn't, there isn't one of the actual side quests. <laughs> yeah. um, I don't know, I don't know what the actual best play is. I'll, I'll leave it up to you. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to throw the dog in. Okay, good boy. Yeah. And it's a critical it's a hit. Critical hit. Can I critically save? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> oh no, come on. Over in the bold. What have you got? No, no. He's dead. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you got anything you can save yourself um, with? Fumbling I had a plan. If you'd missed one of these attacks, I could have. Um, could have done a, a series of things. Oh, I have! I forgot! Because he's got the hood and the plate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're he, re-rolls, he re-rolls his defense dice. Oh, you've got a re-roll on it. I've got a re-roll. Cool, cool, cool. Go for it. Okay, so the power of Cataphrain will protect me. Uh, that no. way. That no. way. He's dead. He's fucking dead. <laughs> <laughs> if he, oh my god, you literally just cut me down. He should have learned his lesson. It's obviously not worth going after those armory bits. Shit. Oh, man, if he'd lived... The plan. Let me let me tell you the plan. Have you got the plan? He was going to bring down the the pearl of thunder. He was going to smack his hammer mm. and push you guys out of the way. Yeah. With and um, also distraction. 
Oh. So per he was going to hammer one of them away, mm -hmm. then he was going to distract the other one out of the way. Mm -hmm. I was going to play Consecrated Area. Mm -hmm. No no one touching my guy Yeah. on Butcher Point. Perfect planning, I didn't move. Mm -hmm. And then Flawless Strategy, I finished my other all my other objectives. Yeah. Three more points. And then I would have spent those points on two more bits of armor. Would have got the locket and the belt. Uh. And I would have gone into the final round then like fully equipped. Fully, fully Voltron up. <laughs> yeah. But Murder Brigade just fucking chopped him up before he could put his pants on. Well, I think Literally, he, you caught him with his belt down. Well, I did, I, I've got a horrible feeling that... I mean, I was... These guys mm. aren't going to get that much better or really be able to Voltron up mm. or anything. And there doesn't seem to be a huge amount of chaining I can do with this stuff. Yeah. So I think this really is an alpha strikey kind of... You just of have to go in and murder them before get they get good. Get you killed before turn two. Mm. Or before turn three. Um, oh God, yeah. Well, there was only one turn left, and, and then it would have just been Voltron the Bold against three guys. <laughs> I don't know if he could have handled it, in all honesty. <laughs> uh, he might might have done. But yeah, so the dog the dog did well. dog did amazingly. Killed, what, two out of three? Mm. He's a good boy. The best boy. Shouldn't have hesitated swinging on him. Yes. Extra, extra skulls for him tonight. Now the thing is, I don't think I've learned anything, really. No, a little bit, a little bit. Short of like getting the mechanics a little bit better as to how yeah. the game plays, I don't think I've really learnt all that much. But we'll see because you, you, uh, you had quite a intricate looking strat just then. Yeah, quite a lot of things going on. I think I played it quite wrong. I should have, mm. I should have deployed back here. Yeah, and just rummaged around over here. Would have taken you mm. more time. I was a bit surprised that you were right on. I just, yeah, I think my instincts are to fight, but mm. this build of deck <laughs> is hide around here mm. and uh, until you've found the superpower armor. Yeah, <laughs> and then and then see what it does. <laughs> yeah, and then hope it's good. <laughs> Well, yeah. Let us know what you think of this new style of mm. recording, because yeah. should this video should look very different from yeah. the last few. Yeah, it's sort of it's a bit tighter. It's just me and Ben. A mm. little bit of extra strategy. Yeah. Do you like Do you like that bit That's where we strategy. go? We walk out the room and talk about plans. I don't know. Is that, is that cheesy? Is it fun? Is it good. Is it tedious? It's the best thing you've ever seen. If it is, then like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> And share with all your friends. Share with your friends and see us next time. Tell us what other games we're playing. Oh, and send us a song. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because this is all new, yeah. not Battle Boys. Yeah, this is... So we need a new theme tune. Battle I can see your boys, <laughs> take me home. <laughs> to <laughs> the games. <laughs> Something about <laughs> dice. <laughs> I think that's already taken. Yeah. I'll leave that for someone else. Alright. Alright. Cool. cool. See, See you next time.